Hi everyone, uh, today we're going to be talking about building a team for your open textbook project. This is a really important part of the process uh, that starts right from day one and so I'll be talking a little bit about why teams are important, what teams look like and how if you're in a leadership position you can be uh, working on managing, developing and managing a team. So to start I think it's important to acknowledge up front that uh, these projects are always going to involve lots of people. There's kind of a bit of a myth around sometimes about writing a book as a solo endeavour. There's, you know, one person shut away in a room somewhere for, for a year to, to write the text. Um, but there are always more people involved uh, in, in creating these texts and in uh, developing them and getting them out to the world. Um, and so it's, it's going to be part of your experience and so it's important to put some time into thinking about what that team should look like uh, and how you can kind of bring it together in, in a really positive way. So aside from the obvious things like teams being important, being important to help share the workload, um, we really think it's, it's key that they also give opportunities to bring in diverse perspectives uh, and experiences to, to really help shape the resource and develop it in ways that you might not have originally thought of and to give you, you know, a place to bounce ideas off each other and help develop it in that sense. It also gives you a built-in network for your team that you immediately have people who have their own networks who are excited about it, who can be sharing calls for contributors or, or helping to market the book once it's released, and there may also be potential adopters themselves as well. That same community we see as being really important for the long-term success of books as well, that having people invested and, and understanding the project uh, and, and avenues for them to be participating is really important to, to keep it going over the long run, that you've put this hard work in up front and you want it to, to survive and, and, and be out in the world for a long time and, and useful for people in the long run. And then finally, it's really important to remember that having a team can be really fun. Uh, it can make this experience really enjoyable uh, to have other people around you who care about the same things you do, who are invested in this vision, and, and that you're working towards something together. It uh, can be a great time um, and really make the, all the difference when you're working on one of these projects.